What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about all the different updates that ESO receives throughout the year and how a lot of people in the community don't think that the big changes like to armor, to you know skills, to abilities, all that kind of stuff should happen as often as it does. A lot of players out there say that you know we don't have the time to play every day, grind every day. We only have to play a couple hours a day, maybe on the weekends. And of course when it comes to life, work, family, that stuff always comes first. And so you kind of feel like you're stuck when it comes to ESO because you come in grind out some new gear and then within a couple months that's changing with the next patch. Uh, I know I got some comments yesterday on the video that I made about the light and medium armor changes how people were saying they're gonna have to go out and rebuild their character. Even if you're not going for a best in slot build, even if you're going for something you just want to enjoy, you want to mess around with, it's still a lot of work to have to go in and grind all that out again. You know rank that gear up, pay gold, get materials and then you turn around and that epic gear or that gold gear you have it's kind of just useless and you have to change it up again, re-roll it or go out and farm something new completely. I think the updates they do to combat and, and abilities, things that are nerfs, buffs, that kind of stuff should probably only happen once or twice a year. One time might not be enough unless that is decided to, you know, if something's game breaking, if something's broken, if something's not working correctly in PVE or PVP, they might can go in and just do a small patch to change that one item. But I think overall, these changes should only happen once or twice a year. That way it gives players time to be able to grind out the gear, you know, level it up to whatever, you know, purple or, or gold, uh, you know, a quality that they would like it kind of at, and then have time to play with it before they feel like they're just going out and changing it up all over again within a couple of months. And the thing that's kind of been frustrating to me over the years is that when a new update comes out, and I'm sure you have noticed this uh, yourself if you pay attention to everything that goes on within the public test server, it seems like as soon as an update comes out, I'll take Blackwood for example, as soon as Blackwood came out, within four weeks the public test server was pretty much up again for the DLC that we're about to get, the Waking Flame DLC. So PC players have already had a look at what was going to change, so they can kind of go ahead and you know inform the community about this is going to change, this is going to change. And I think people see that and they kind of get frustrated because you're grinding something out in the new update and then you already kind of know that most everything you're grinding in this new update is about to change in the next update. That is a very frustrating thing for all players, whether you play all the time or whether only, whether only you get to play, you know, a couple hours a day or just like I said on the weekends. That gets to be a bit much and I think it kind of makes that grind too much for some players. And I do understand that it is uh, frustrating. It's the one thing that ESO has done that I will say that is one of my biggest complaints. The one thing that I just do not agree with. I think they should allow players to have more time to figure out their builds and be able to learn how to use their builds uh, before they are just changing things in and out all the time. I think updates should be handled, bugs, performance, new content, and then maybe once or twice a year, nerfs, buffs, changes to, like I said, armor, skills, abilities, and you know, whatnot. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. Do you like the way, the, like the formula that they use to kind of do these updates? Are you a big fan of every single update, every couple months, four times a year, everything that you have pretty much having to be redone or changed or re-rolled or re-farmed or whatever the case may be? I do understand that a lot of people in the community don't like it. It's been a topic for a really long time, like I said, between community members, content creators. A lot of us have had an issue with this and I do understand why some people are still frustrated to this day and some new players are even frustrated. They feel like I'm a new player. I've gotten to levels, you know, CP 160. I farmed what I needed and then the next update it changes. And I'm still trying to learn the game. It just gets to be a lot. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliate here on the channel Empire Jerky. I'll catch you all next time. Peace.